Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Ben K. Today, let's talk about another important concept in Modelka models. It's called singularity. Usually, after you finish your model and uh, and you check your model in Daimola or Open Modelka, you may you might come across some issues called uh, models are structurally singular. So you might spend a lot of time to fix this issue. It's very bothering. Here, I summarized two reasons. Reason number one is your number equations is not equal to your number of variables. And the reason two is even your number equations equal to number of unknown variable, you might still have some issue there. For the first reason, It has two subcategories called overdetermined. That means your number equations is bigger than your number unknown variables. That means you have more than enough equations to solve your unknown variables. Similarly, for underdetermined, that your number equations is smaller than your number of unknown variables. That means you don't have enough equations to solve your unknown variables. For second reason, you still have two subcategories. One, your model is mathematically might be incorrect. That means your, your, from your equations, it's not pos possible to solve your unknown variable, to solve the equation to get the unknown variables. Another common reason is even your model is mathematically correct by your number of degree of freedoms in the equations is smaller than or bigger than usually smaller than the number of variables. For example, one variable is missing from the equations. Okay, next let's go through the four reasons with the four examples respectively. Number one, singularity by overdetermined. Here, I have one variable, but I have two equations. But let's go to open modelica. Overdetermined. Let's check the model here first. Two equations, one variable. Two, equ two equations here, one variable here. But let's run the model. Okay, as you can see that we got some error here. Too many equations, overdetermined system. The model has two equations and variables. So in order to fix that, I just remove some equation here. For example, we remove the second equation. Then we can simulate the model. As you can see that it went through here. It has it's a little bit slow here. Okay, the simulation is finished. Check my X. Here is my readout. Okay, let's go back to slides. Next example, singularity by underdetermined. Here I have two variables, X and Y, but I only get one equation. So I have not enough equation to solve my variable here. So that means underdetermined. So let's go through the example in Open Modelica. Let me close it here. Okay, two variables, one equation. Check the model. 
one equivalence, two variables, run the simulation. Here it says two field equations underdetermined as we don't have enough equations. The model has equation has one equation, two variables. In order to fix that, we can because we don't have enough equations. So we need to add another equation, say y plus x equal to one, for example. Then let's rerun the model here. As you can see that the interface is a little bit different than just now. So it's compiling, it's like doing a compilation for the model. So it's a little bit slow here. Okay. It sounds like path through here. Okay. So simulation is finished. This is my X. This is my Y. Okay. Let's go back to slides. Let's go to example three. The singularity because of your incorrect mass out there. For example, I have number equations two number of variables 2, they are equal, but mathematically, they are incorrect here. Because from the first, from the second equations, my x equal to 4 or minus 4. But from the first equation, as you can see that the ratio of 4 plus 2 equal because equal to 0 because 0 plus 2 equals 2 so it's not equal to 5 so that means mathematically this is incorrect so that's why it's a singularity issue let's go through example in the open modelica let me close this one okay x and y so let me change that a little bit to 16 All right okay so let's let's check the model first two equations two variables that's right okay here i got some internal error it says Internal error field system is structurally singular and cannot be handled. Right? So, in order to fix that, you can change here a little bit. Then let's rerun the model. Looks like I went through here and can wait a couple seconds here until the compile are being finished. Okay, that's a good sign. Okay, that's a good sign. Check X and y okay that's the result okay let's go back to slides the first reading even your mathematically even your number equations equal to your number variables plus mathematically they are correct for the equations but your equation degree of freedom is not equal to the number of variables for them your y here, for example, I have two equations here and I have two variables. For example, let's solve the equation here very quick. Here, you can see that from the first equation, 
you can see that your x equal to square root 5. Square root of 5 to the power of 2, so 5 by 5 to 2. So if x to the power of 4, that means we have 25 plus 5 equals 30. So that means mathematically they are correct, but their y is meeting from the equation. So but the model will still the, the compiler will still complain that this is singularity. Let's go back to the open modelica. Okay. Have the same model here. Let's check the model first. Two equations, two variables. Let's run the model. Okay, as you can see that the complaint here, internal error, something failed, system is structured singular, cannot be handled. So in order to fix that, because we, the y is missing from the equation, for example, we can change the one variable here to y, whatever you want to do. So let's rerun the model. So it's a little bit slow here for the compile. Okay, that's good sign here. And okay, I got the readout. Okay, they're all constant value here. So let's go back to slides. Okay. I think I'll cover all the four examples corresponding to the four major reasons here that you might be failed for a model check. So hopefully my video can be helpful when you do Modelka models. Hopefully I can see you in my next videos. Thank you.